Namaste. And welcome back to Grow with the Jan family. I am JD. And I'm Anjali. How much a hey? Can I say hey up? And today we're going to be reacting to a new trailer that just came out yesterday. Mm, yeah. Co well, you all right back there? Yep. Mm hmm. Boy, he falls out of his chair all the time. <laughs> um, the new trailer is called Tapad. Yeah. I think. Mm -hmm. Daddy tried to tell me it. It's kind of a. Yeah. Anyways. I want to say how I say it. Yeah, how did, did you say it? Tapad. Yeah, Tapad. The pod? That's how I would say it. Okay. The pod. All right. So it says down below that it is a relationship story that seems perfect, but life is shattered with a slap. Ooh. And Daddy told us that's what to pod means. Yeah. Slap. And um, but is one slap enough to question the, what the relationship stands for, or does it shake up her trust? So this will be an interesting mm -hmm. trailer to see, right? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, so let's see what this real movie's really all about yeah. and start it up. Oh yeah. Illegal notice hai aapko ghar wapas le jane ke liye. Mujhe nahi jana hai. What's the real story? His family? No. He's having an affair? No. You're having an affair? No. So just one slap then. Just a slap? Par nahi maar sakta. Mm -hmm. कंपनी में इतने इमोशनली इन्वेस्टेड थे यू कुड नॉट मूव ऑन मैंने तो अपनी पूरी लाइफ इन्वेस्ट करी है तुम्हारे साथ कैसे मूव ऑन करूं आई डोंट लव यू बस यही सुनना रह गया था बेटी डाइवोर्स करेगी जाने दे बेटा थोड़ा बर्दाश्त करना सीखना चाहिए औरतों को हर रिश्ता फ्लॉड होता है उसे जोड़ के रखना पड़ता है जोड़ के रखनी पड़े कोई चीज तो मतलब टूटी हुई है ना दीदी कल उसने फेर मारी पर कल है ना मैंने सोची किसी दिन इस ने अंदर तक कुंडी लगा ली तो तू कहाँ जाएगी रिश्ते बनाने में अपनी एफर्ट नहीं लगती जितना निभाने में लगती है क्या करूँ हो गया ना ज्यादा जरूरी भी सवाल ये है ऐसा हुआ क्यों यू शुड गिव चांस इमेजिन हाउ एम्बेस्ड ऑलरेडी इज सबसे ज्यादा नुकसान अमू का है इसके ऊपर डिवोसी का टैग लगेगा गलत तो नहीं करे ना हम तो हमेशा सही सोच के करते हैं बेटा और कई बार सही करने का रिजल्ट हैप्पी नहीं होता When you're truly in love, थोड़ी बहुत मारपीट तो expression of love ही है ना सर। We no. have eyewitness testimony कि उस रात पार्टी में कोई violent act commit नहीं किया था। अगली petition में ये भी लिखा देना कि मैं शराबी, पागल और manic depressive हूँ क्योंकि अभी incomplete लग रही है। You still want to play fair? उसने मुझे मारा पहली बार नहीं मार सकता। बस इतनी सी बात है और मेरी petition भी इतनी सी। पता उस थप्पड़ से क्या हुआ उस एक थप्पड़ से ना मुझे वो सारी अनफेयर चीजें साफ साफ दिखने लग गई जिसको मैं अनदेखा करके मूव ऑन करती जा रही थी The director did an awesome job. He really does making it from the woman's perspective, like recreating like, it and yeah. like pulling it all together. Yeah, it definitely yeah. gave you that feel. It was from her side yeah. and her yeah. feelings. You could yes. really um cuz we don't get the whole story from yeah. this trailer. No. You get some clips of good stuff yeah. and then we don't get like everyone's perspective. Yeah. It's like just hers. It's mainly from yeah. her side, which which is really great that he does that, that he pulls that yeah. together and you really get that feel that it's it's her story. Um it gives mm -hmm. you glimpses of the good life that they had. So it wasn't and all And then what bad. happened afterwards? Then what happens at the party which Yeah is like the end all for her yeah. like she's like he slapped me well in front of everybody so it's party. like party yeah yeah that was um yeah not that he should have hit her anyways but to hit her in public in front of her friends and family yeah. 
was huge. And then she says in, in some parts, like, she, it kind of woke her up to the things that she wasn't seeing before. Or she ignored or She was ignoring. Yeah. And then you get those, like, black and white clips of, like, stuff mm-hmm. that maybe happened between them. And so it's kind of like her, you yeah. know, trying to go through the divorce um, process and they're asking her what happened, mm-hmm. you know, and there's there's not like a big story behind her. She's like, he slapped me and he should have never done that. Yeah. And um, yeah, we don't condone violence in the family. No. But there is like a whole another story, I think, behind it that mm-hmm. we don't know all of it. And, you know, I kind of wish we got like both sides of the yeah point of view like his side and then her side like both point of views yeah it definitely gives more of her perspective from the trailer anyways yeah maybe in the movie you get a little bit more of his version of it mm-hmm. but you definitely get the feeling from her that she's upset and it kind of triggered all these other memories of stuff that she felt mm-hmm. like maybe was you know bad you know like yeah it was that wasn't that was kind of the breaking point maybe for her But I think, you know, even though that was the breaking point, I feel like there should have still been a process of talking it out and figuring it out. Like why it happened and what was going on. Like what happened, what led up to that? Is there, you know, something Mm -hmm. that can be resolved? You know, no, he shouldn't have hit her. Mm -hmm. Um, But was it... Was that the end? You know, you mm-hmm. guys seem like you were in love and parts, you know, yeah. mm-hmm. everybody fights mm-hmm. at some point, some more than others. But I feel mm-hmm. like when you live in a family, especially in mm-hmm. India, I know it's like the family, it's like not only mom and dad yeah. and the kids, but it's grandparents, it's in-laws, it's, you know, cousins. That It's huge. Huge and family, so, yeah. Everybody's not going to get along all the time, every time, you know. And so was this, like, a bunch of other stories we don't know? And so that's why it escalated to where she felt like she needed to divorce. Yeah, when you live in a house, you're going to... When have you have conflict. Yeah, there's yeah. going to be conflict. Not that you don't love each other. Mm-hmm. Um, and I think that's where... But it's like you don't agree on some things and things happen. Like, nobody's perfect. Right. Mm-hmm. And my other theory in this, too, is like, when you come home, you know that no matter how crappy a day you had mm-hmm. at work or at school, sometimes you come home and you take that crap out on the people you love. Not intentionally. No. But you come home when you're in a grumpy mood and mm-hmm. so maybe Jaden wants me to do something and I'm like, no, I don't want to do that for you. Because I've had a crappy day or him and Noah are playing, but they're screaming really loud. And I'm like, oh my God, I have a headache from screaming babies at school. Please stop screaming. And I yell at him um, a lot louder than that. But And I still do it. And he still does it. And then I get angry and I yell at him again. I still love him. I'm yeah. still cooking him dinner. So there's like that, you have to find that fine mm-hmm. line. Like, I feel like. You have to know like where to stop. But, like, where to start, like, you have to do something about it. Otherwise, it will just keep going on. Right, right. If every day is a fight and every day is misery. Like, and that every shouldn't day happen. You're getting slapped. Then, oh, yeah. Then there's there's no yeah, it's end all done. to that. Yeah. But if there was at one point you were in love and there mm-hmm. were good things and you have a lot of good things. I think the Indian culture... And you have, like, a future. Yeah. yeah. Even without kids. There doesn't seem to be kids in this. No. Kids definitely bring a different... A whole different perspective yeah. when it's a family. But I do think, like, um, the Indian culture definitely yeah. has that togetherness. Yeah. And here mm-hmm. in the West, we seem to have gotten into... I, I feel like I don't want people to make rash decisions quickly and that's what it seems a little bit here like the slap happened okay it's over there's a done Mm -hmm. deal which not that it's okay but i just feel like there should be like a process like there should be like let's talk it out let's see what's happening right did you have a bad day like is it something different yeah why did it it get to that yeah what made you snap and yeah because here in the U.S., I feel like we have a lot more like, oh, the kids turn 18, they get out, kick them out of the house, they're gone, yoo-hoo, or 
I, you know, I was fighting with my wife and so we got divorced. Now I have a new wife, you know, and she's younger and prettier and, or I have three, three wives and, you know, a bunch of kids from different people. The, the togetherness, the living close together, the living, you know, near each other. I feel like kids go off to school here and they go off to school there and they get married, they move away. Like there isn't that knit like there is in India. Mm -hmm. And so, you know there should still be some mm -hmm. women voices yeah. mm -hmm. out there. Like, I don't want to say that, um, you know, the violence People is okay. Don't have a voice. But yeah. there should be a, is this a, a cycle, a bad mm -hmm. cycle, or is this like something that we can work through? Because in a family, mm -hmm. there's a lot of factors involved, a lot of yeah. people involved, and yeah. It, mm -hmm. it, like here at the Jan family, it looks like all smiles on camera. <laughs> But, you know, we fight here, too. Mm -hmm. uh, my husband, we fight sometimes, and, and the kids hear it. But, you know, it may take some time before mm -hmm. we resolve it. But you always do. So. Right. So there's always that talk it through and figure it out. And, okay, what do we need to change our person because mm -hmm. we're having stress at work? Of or, the little things, yeah. Yeah. Or, like, when we yell at you because you guys don't do your homework. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody needs to come and do homework with Jaden. Guy, it takes no. like an hour. <laughs> <laughs> and and, yeah. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Like, Daddy yells at you, too, when you don't have good grades or something happens yeah. at school and he gets a call from, you know, teachers or something. We, But it's all in we want better for you yeah it's all in like good things for the future like mm -hmm. it's not like you're yelling at somebody for no apparent reason it's like you want us to have a good future you want us to like, mm -hmm. live a good life right we want yeah, good things for you mommies. and we love even though i yell at him sometimes and i yell at her sometimes <laughs> you don't ever see it on camera um <laughs> We all still love each other, mm -hmm. right? In the end, it's still a family. So yeah. we hope that uh, that the Western culture doesn't taint too much of the Override. Indian culture. Yeah, yeah we'd yeah. like to bring some more of that familyness, mm -hmm. closeness, people living together, being together, and mm -hmm. and being because that's where your support system. That's who's going to mm -hmm. help you out in the end and be there when you need them. So, mm -hmm. anyways, we went on and on and on, but I hope you guys liked this video. And don't forget to subscribe. And join the wonderful Jam family. And we'll see you all tomorrow. tomorrow. Bye. Bye.